Hi guys, this is Arkel here, and I'm just making a random little update video, just something random. I want to go ahead and show you guys um, where I keep my dolls, usually, uh, just because I thought it would be kind of fun and I haven't really like uh, shown you guys yet. I'm sure you guys have seen a while back um, on my main channel, I did like my workspace tour. So this is the top of my um, desk. I, it's changed quite a bit. I should actually do a new workspace tour video. Since, I mean, mostly the, the change has been up here, but anyway, um, I can actually, now I keep my dolls up here, and I wanted to go ahead and show you guys, sorry, I'm like holding the light in my other hand, I'm not even kidding you, I have a light in one hand and the camera in the other. <laughs> anyway, so of course this is Faustus here, he's actually trying on some clothes which aren't for him, and the eyes as well. Um... I'm sure you guys who follow my DeviantArt know that I'm expecting some new dolls soon. Ah, I'm so excited. Um, so I have this like little cute jacket thing, um, which is actually for River whenever he comes. He should be coming soon, I hope, within the next month or two, I'm hoping. Um, but anyway, uh, this is Faustus, and he's also not, these are not his eyes, although they look gorgeous in him. They're cat eye pupils. These are actually for my Eileen doll dragon. Um, Lapis, um, whose name I've decided is going to be Zephyrus, and it's cool because I got these eyes from Soldal, and half, uh, one side of the eye uh, is yellow, and the other side is this really pretty purple, and I kind of want my dragon to have like different colored eyes, so it'd be cool to sort of swap, like swap those around if that makes sense. I'm sorry, I'm like talking pretty fast. Um, but anyway, these look so amazing in, in his eyes. I really want to get him cat eye pupils now, but they don't actually, like, they're not canon to his character. But anyway, so Faustus usually sits here kind of by himself because, you know, if you guys know about his story, you kind of know why he uh, kind of sits by himself. Um, anyway, uh, I have some, like, random cute things on my desk. You guys know that I love having a bunch of cute stuff. Like, I have a little junkie spot card up here, and those are some, like, Japanese stickers back there. That little hair bow is actually something that I wore when I was in pageants as a little kid. Um, these are some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. These are some really, really old ones that I've had since forever. Um, two of my favorites from the very first... Oh, there's that red light again. Uh, from the very first generation of Yu-Gi-Oh, um, I'm sure you guys who have watched the first season of Yu-Gi-Oh, um, first generation, know very well these cards. Um, Blue Eyes White Dragon is, of course, uh, the favorite of Kaiba. And Change of Heart is the favorite of Bakora. So, yes, uh, random little thingies. I made this little polymer clay apple a while ago. I think I showed you guys. Anyway, here is, I'm rambling, as always. Uh, if my camera will focus, there we go. Uh, this, of course, is Shu, and he's wearing his adorable little, I don't know if you can see it, it's like a little unicorn, um, like a little crochet hat. I got this specifically for him, so he would like, because obviously he's not a unicorn, um, like his other two members of his trio, so I thought it'd be really cute if uh, he had a little unicorn hat, like, look at me, I'm a unicorn too, <laughs> or something like that. Anyway, he's wearing things that definitely do not fit him, but I think they're really cute on him. Their shoe, he's always so cute. Even if his eyes are incredibly creepy, I'm sorry. <laughs> And, of course, here's my lovely lady. I don't know if you can see her. There's Calliope. And she's also wearing some stuff that does not belong to her, but whatever. My dolls seem to all just share things. So, yeah. I did mention, I don't know, yeah, I did mention on my DeviantArt that I'm expecting another doll, but I didn't say who it was. But I'm sure that a particular item of clothing that she's wearing, or accessory, I should say, might give it away for those of you guys who watch my DeviantArt or my YouTube actually. I'm not gonna say exactly what item that is but I'm sure it's not too hard to figure out. Um, but anyway, <laughs> so yeah she looks really cute. Um, I try not to get an angle where it looks up her skirt but it doesn't really matter. She's wearing <laughs> she's uh, she's wearing leggings anyway and there's these really cool like galaxy pattern. So Anyway, uh, and then I just have some manga over here that I've had for a while, some little ceramic things that I've made, a picture, you know, this hilarious mannequin which I pose in all the most ridiculous poses. There's some of my art, of course, over there, if you guys can see that. Some hand sanitizer up there. 
my hand mannequin, my graduation thing, a little finger pointer, that art in the back over there that's um, not the one of shoe over here, but that one back there was actually made um, by a uh, person on YouTube who's a fan of mine, so that's really nice. Um, All right, anyway, sorry guys, my camera totally just died because I'm really smart and I totally check the camera battery before I record something. Um, <laughs> anyway, I just wanted to go ahead and make a quick little video um, and just show you guys my little workspace. Uh, or my little doll space, I should say. It is my workspace, but it's my doll space. There's actually some of my face-up stuff and whatnot down there. Underneath my little sayings and stuff, and that's like makeup and weird, just random junk that collects in there. Um, but yeah, and that's where I keep my finished art and the art that I'm working on. And yeah. I forgot where I left off, I'm sorry. But anyway, um, just wanted to make a quick little video to show you guys that. Um, I'm really sorry for not really posting a lot of art, or if any, really, um, on YouTube for the last, like, month. I'm really, really sorry about that. I've, um, just been really busy with college and whatnot, and, um, it's just been hard to find time to, because, I mean, I usually take anywhere from, like, 8 to 40 hours to finish one piece of artwork, and just with how busy I am, it's really hard to just sit down and devote that much time to it and to actually get anything done. And I feel a little bad, you know, if I make things that are really, like, I don't want to say, like, low quality, but very simplistic. And, you know, I want to put out art that's really, what's the word? I don't know, that really, like, showcases, like, you know, my skill and things that I'm proud of. So it's hard for me to not do that. Um... Yeah, but anyway, um, I don't want to make this sort of like a sad video, but I'm going to be making more videos soon. Um, I just have a little hard time, but I thought I would go ahead and make this and show you guys where I keep my dolls because they're really cute and adorable and they're just, ah, they're so cute. I don't know where I'll keep all the other ones once I get them here, but whatever, I'll find a space for them. So anyway, there's Faustus there. He's so cute. My DS is also here as well. I put a bunch of stickers on it. <laughs> Anyway, um, so yeah, I'll uh, see you guys later.